From this video, you will learn how to multiply a fraction by a whole number. So, this, this 2 over 5 times 3. 2 over 5 is a fraction and 3 is a whole number. So, we are going to multiply this fraction by this whole number. So, how to do that? At first step, you need to rewrite the problem. That is, uh, this is this 3 is a whole number. So, you can consider this whole number as a fraction taking 1 as a denominator. Now, your task is to multiply these two fractions together. So, multiply the top numbers and then bottom numbers. So, top numbers is 2 times 3 and bottom numbers is 5 times 1. 2 times 3 is 6 and 5 times 1 is 5. Look, 6 over 5. If you get numerator greater than denominator then you need this fraction is called improper fraction improper fraction we usually convert improper fraction to mixed number so how to do that just you need to divide the numerator by the denominator 5 goes into 6 how many times 1 times 1 times 5 5 if you subtract then you will get 1 now quotient is the whole number and remainder is the numerator and divisor is the denominator so one and one fifth is the answer this is a mixed number because it has whole number part and fractional part so let us consider this fraction this is a mixed number and this is a whole number so how to multiply a mixed fraction by a whole number so at first, you need to rewrite the whole number as a fraction, taking 1 as a denominator. Then, you need to convert this mixed fraction to improper fraction. So, whole number times denominator plus numerator divided by denominator times 3 over 1. Now, 5 plus 2 divided by 5 times 3 over 1. So here we are getting 7 over 5 times 3 over 1. Now you need to multiply top numbers 7 times 3 then bottom numbers. So we are getting here 21 divided by 5. Now this is also an improper fraction because numerator is greater than denominator. So, divide 21 by 5. 5 goes into 21 how many times? 4 times. 4 times 5, 20. Subtract 1. So, you are getting, look, whole number 4. Then, uh, here the remainder will be the numerator and divisor will be the denominator. And this is the answer.